Hi, I'm Lee Stevens with HD Supply. This video is going to cover testing the windings of your compressor. When working with electrical, if you are uncomfortable, please consult a professional. Follow all of OSHA's lockout tagout procedures as it is a requirement. Also follow all of your company's policies and procedures when working with electrical. And remember your personal protective equipment, your safety glasses, and your gloves. To test the windings on the compressor, you first need to remove the retaining clip. Then remove your relay overload. This is exposing your three terminals. Set your meter to ohms and test between the windings. First, test common to run. This is your lowest ohms reading of approximately five. Then test common to start. That's your next ohms reading, approximately seven on this model. And then test from your start to your run, which is a combination of the other two in this model, approximately 12. If these readings are all similar, your compressor is shorted and needs to be replaced. Next, test each three terminals to ground. If any of these show continuity or grounded, then your terminal is grounded and it is a bad compressor and needs to be replaced.